Good morning, YouTube. It's Wednesday, March the 8th, 2017, and today we're going to be traveling around taking a look at some rather unique pieces of New York history as well as sort of world history. Something you've all seen before and you probably all remember but had no idea where it happened at. What could I be talking about? Let's go find out. Welcome to Hidden History, New York. You could say Memorial Field in Mount Vernon, New York, has been the epicenter for a lot of historical events. In 1979, Coca-Cola filmed a rather famous commercial in this very grandstand. More on that in a moment. In the county of Westchester, New York, it is the sole surviving example of the golden age of municipal stadium design. Yes, there were many others, but their footprint has faded, and the booming cheers of victory are now ghosts in the wind. The last several decades have not been kind to Memorial Field. Being closed due to neglect, mismanagement, and illegal dumping, these actions have threatened to erase the great history of this park. But Mayor Richard Thomas has thrown a flag on the play. His administration is addressing the pollution, decay, and the loss of major revenue for the area. Hopes are that an accomplishable remediation plan can be put in place so restoration and redevelopment of the field can begin in the next 18 months to two years. Walking up to the property, we can see a pair of ticket booths made of brick. You can also tell that it's been a long time since anyone has purchased a ticket for Memorial Field. Colonial Army troops under command of John Glover camped on this field and into the town of Pelham on October 17, 1776. The next morning, they clashed with British forces marching in from Pelham Bay. This became the Battle of Pelham, which created a running skirmish and blocking maneuver culminating in the Battle of White Plains. The massive main grandstand is built of brick and limestone, with 12 beautiful arches on each side of the main entrance. The old bronze dedication placards appear to have been removed at some point. Hey kid, catch! A television advertisement for Coca-Cola starring Pittsburgh Steelers defensive tackle Mean Joe Green debuted on October 1st, 1979. The commercial, officially titled Mean Joe Green, was created by McCann Erickson. It took three days to film in Mount Vernon in this very grandstand. This 60-second commercial won a Clio Award for being one of the best television commercials of 1979.
biggest saving grace from Memorial Field is that Mayor Thomas truly appreciates the amazing history that has happened at this property. The amazing athletes that have come from Mount Vernon, such as Dijah Stevens, the Bracca brothers, John and Ralph, Ben Gordon, and Lowe's Moore, as well as many others. Mount Vernon creates legends and will continue to in the future. While it appears Memorial Field is in its final quarter, the city of Mount Vernon is making an honest and politically transparent effort to clean up the site and to redevelop the field. Mayor Thomas and his team have their playbook in hand, and it is with their clear vision for the future that hopefully Memorial Field will once live again. So for now, I'm going to root for the home team and cheer on that hope for victory, for a brighter future, for our Mount Vernon. So that about wraps it up for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you can come back next week. If you enjoyed, give us a thumbs up. Please subscribe. And we'll see you next week with Hidden History New York. Thanks again for watching.